every player in, in sports needs to have a routine that they go through uh, before practice or during practice or uh, before games. Uh, in volleyball, when you have a team game, I think it's really important to have a warm-up that, that gets them ready uh, for all the movements and all the touches that they could possibly have in the game. So that's the purpose of our warm-up. As you see the players now, they're going to underhand pass the ball from 10, 20, and 30 feet. They're going to overhand pass the ball from 10, 20, and 30 feet. Here they're having each type of movement that you would need. We like that when you move backwards that you shuttle. When you come forward you run. As the drill goes on, it gets more and more detailed. You also see side to side movement at the very end. But before then, you see a crossover step. So in this, you're not only handling the ball underhand and overhand from all parts of the court, you're also moving in every way that you would need to to play volleyball. Now, why do we do this as a group? You do this as a group because the most important thing in volleyball is rhythm. The worst thing in volleyball is hesitation. So we have them call the ball. The bonus becomes learning how to talk and learning how to communicate consistently. And secondly, is because they talk, and because we define how high the ball should be, they do develop rhythm out of it, because as you see, the balls are all at the same height. So by the time the team's warmed up, they've done all the movement that they would need to use in the court. 